and welcome back to this week's video. I am Megan J. Let's do this. Uh huh. Let's go. Doing whatever I feel like doing. It's Megan J. And she feels like grooving. New videos uploaded every Wednesday. So click subscribe and have a great day. Hey. So I had a projector in my bedroom, just this one, just very basic. I really enjoyed it. Um, it was just like a spontaneous, I think, wish purchase, and I, I really enjoyed having it. And over time, this one's just kind of gotten not so great anymore. I decided to upgrade, and I don't typically do these kind of like electronic videos, but I was like so excited. So I decided I'm gonna do an unboxing and testing video. I got a new projector from Amazon. And the brand is Me Aura. I'm super excited to set it up, open it up, and test it out. I did quite a bit of research on this. I read a lot of reviews, and it's supposed to be pretty decent, and it was only like 150 bucks. So let's open it up. So we have this fabulous piece of foam. We've got nice little remote what i'm assuming is the power cord and power adapter we've got a user manual i mean great to have but whoever reads those man oh it's got a nice little leather handle we have the projector it's got a nice like leather feeling type handle got our connections in the back power button on top and let's peel this puppy off tap the inside and a nice little lens what else is in the box nothing we're gonna go set it all up and see how she works I'm really excited it's not super loud that's for sure and we've got it set up on the wall it just finished loading and we're gonna adjust all the settings and adjust the size. This projector has auto keystone correction and it also has manual in the position that I have my projector. It's on a bit of an angle. I ended up doing a manual keystone projection and I'm not really all that tech savvy anymore. So it was pretty easy for me, very simple setup. And this one is so clear, so much clearer than my other projector. I couldn't read any of these words. Future editing Megan here. Yes, I am outside editing because I'm getting some fresh air while it's sunny. I've had some very questionable weather here, so you gotta take it where you can get it. In case you don't know what a keystone is, if you're not tech savvy like me, that is the way that the screen projects onto the wall. And when you have it on an angle like I do, you have to adjust it so that it doesn't look all wonky on the wall. That makes sense. The only negative comment that I found about this projector on Amazon was that the fan was really loud. But it's really not that loud. I'm putting the microphone right to it. It's really not that loud. I'm not going to be using the apps that come with this. I have a Chromecast hooked up to it. So let's turn that on. And we'll play something. There's the Chromecast. Pretty clear. Hurley has joined us. And now we're just turning on one of my videos. Pretty crystal clear. Let's turn the volume on. Hey, Onboard speaker is not too bad. I'll probably end up hooking up a soundbar to it at some point because the speaker is not amazing, but it is definitely way better than what I had before. The remote, very simple and basic to use, and it's Bluetooth paired, so it works really well. Hi, Hurley. I am not a super tech savvy person and I unboxed this and set it up in under 15 minutes and that's including the time I spent manually correcting the screen thingy. Uh, see, not super tech savvy. I gave this projector a 10 out of 10 because it's 100 times better than this. 100 times better. I'm just really excited to watch movies on a really big screen on my wall. I know if I got a projector screen it would make it Oh, a thousand times better, but I'm really happy with the way this looks and for 150 bucks, I can't really complain. It's really, it's quite good. It's quite good.
Also, in other news, I have very exciting news about my mouth. I am getting my braces off in two weeks. So I'm very excited for that because I'm very over, over, over it. Flossing takes like 45 minutes. It's like a whole ordeal. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe. And I'm sorry if this video wasn't your jam. Well, we'll see you next week. And maybe that video will be your jam. Peace. <laughs>